Hi, this is uh, Max Davis Johnson, uh, OIT, uh, Boise State University. Uh, this is uh, this week in OIT for September uh, 4th, uh, 2012. Actually, it's, it's Wednesday today, so I'm a little bit behind this week uh, with Labor Day and beginning of the semester. So today I just want to uh, talk a little bit about, uh, I'm going to sh show you, talk about some numbers. And I, I like numbers, and so the first number I'm going to show you is this number here, 421. Uh, that's the number of help desk tickets we took uh, on the first day of the semester uh, last week. Uh, and it's about a, about the same number as we had the uh, semester before. I think uh, certainly what was significant is that uh, we had uh, longer lines uh, than we had before uh, in the zone. And I think in some ways that's good news because it means that uh, people have, have figured out that they can go into the zone and get help. And I, I know uh, the help desk staff, the zone staff, the, of the three zones we have now, uh, were extremely busy. Uh, anecdotally, uh, MBEB in, in the new business building, uh, the, the zone wasn't discovered until the second day of the week, uh, of the first week of school, but uh, uh, traffic was, was pretty heavy and consistent, uh, pretty regular once, uh, uh, I think, students discovered uh, that the zone was there in the new business building. Uh, the next number I want to show you is 11,000. Uh, that uh, represents uh, the, the, you know, the highest number of wireless connections we had that first week which actually happened uh, on Wednesday in the middle of the week. Uh, but we've got some new tools this year that allow us to measure uh, wireless usage a little bit better than we had in the past. And again, 11,000, uh, you know, that's uh, at least half our student body plus a few more. So it's good to see it's being used. Um, another number I want to show you is this number, 700. Uh, that represents uh, 700 megabytes. That's the... Uh, Highest amount of bandwidth usage we had coming into uh, uh, campus that first week of school. Uh, fairly, fairly large, large, large number. Uh, uh, you know, we have uh, capacity to, to to certainly exceed that, but that means again, it's mean bandwidth is being used. Uh, another number related to bandwidth is uh, nine three twelve, which actually is uh, September third. 2012, which is Labor Day, and that represents the highest uh, bandwidth usage going into the dorms, which uh, probably means uh, students had gotten back from uh, uh, from uh, the Labor Day break and were probably uh, in the dorm streaming movies. But but again, it just sort of gives you some ideas of some of, some of the patterns we have here. Uh, my favorite number for the week is this number here, 358. And that represents the actual number of lecture captures, classroom captures that we did the first week. Uh, and and that, to me, that's very significant. One, it means that uh, the uh, classroom uh, capture technology that we put in place is being used, it's being scheduled. Uh, one of the things we tried to do for every, uh, uh, especially the first time they were, uh, a professor or instructor was uh, recording the class, and we actually tried we actually had somebody there in the in the classroom uh, to assist in, in case things uh, did, did not go smoothly. Uh, you know, the good news is we had a lot of captures. Uh, more good news is, is that we've learned a lot, and, and certainly we're going to get uh, better in supporting this uh, going forward. But again, uh, thanks uh, to everybody involved in helping make this successful. Uh, not not only the OIT team, but uh, academic technology students for their support in helping uh, get certainly get Blackboard set up and and all the things uh, that they help us get get going there. And the last number I want to show you today is this number 11. And this number is also very significant because it means we have 11 weeks until go live uh, for some major uh, projects uh, as part of our the roadmap project. Uh, we've got the uh, campus solution refresh, i.e. the update of the student system. We, uh, we're physically sp splitting uh, the two uh, uh, HCM and campus solutions uh, from a database perspective. Uh, not a trivial matter, uh, and, and, and that will go live in 11 weeks. Uh, the data warehouse for students will go live in 11 weeks. My Boise State for students uh, will also go live in 11 weeks. 
Uh, we also have what we call a UPK user uh, productivity kit, i.e. documentation, online documentation. Uh, that will go live here in 11 weeks. And then we also have, uh, uh, from an infrastructure standpoint, we are converting uh, the uh, student system to, to new uh, uh, hardware uh, and, and, and moving to a new operating system, i.e. the old AIX to, to a newer version of, uh, of, of Red Hat Linux. So again, uh, 11 weeks, even though we say this is in December, I think it's important for us to realize that even though it seems like a long way off, it is only 11 weeks. And so certainly want to make, uh, and you'll see, act, literally you'll see posters like this. I know I'm not going to hold it before you read it. And each week we will be changing the number because next week it will be 10 weeks uh, until go live for some significant projects. So again, uh, thank you for paying uh, t attention today. And uh, we'll see you uh, next week.